H2K Infosys provides world-class online IT training, staffing and software testing solutions to customers worldwide. H2K Infosys supports 100% job-oriented training, hands-on project work, cloud test lab, resume preparation and review, mock interviews, robust syllabus. One-time pay, lifetime access to live classes and videos. H2K Infosys has won the trust of thousands of students worldwide. For free demo class, visit h2kinfosys.com. Welcome to Agile Demo. Before I start, let me introduce you myself. My name is uh, Shah. I've been working in IT for almost 16 years now. And most of the time, I've been working as business analyst, project manager, and as a scrum master. I have seven years of experience teaching business analysis, project management, and Agile Scrum. As far as my education goes, I'm an MBA graduate from San Jose State University, California. I do also hold PMP certification since July 2006. In this demo session, we shall begin by understanding what is an Agile is. Next, we shall discuss the value-driven approach of Agile. So here we will do a comparison between traditional and Agile way of making a software. After that, we will see as to who can take up this course. Importantly, we shall get some facts about the job market for Agile. Also, we shall look into the modules that will be covered in this course. And at last, some additional points. Let's start with a question, what is Agile? So the definition says, Agile is an approach to develop software that promotes building software incrementally, small module at a time. Before I make everybody understand the Agile approach of value-driven implementation and its advantages, let me first walk you through the traditional approach of making a software. In this session, I would like to explain using online shopping site as an example. Like we all know, there are different stages to develop a software and it always begins with planning. Let's say the planning activity is estimated to be two months. After planning, we do analysis. Just for example, let's say it is estimated to be two months again. Subsequently, design two months, development two months, testing two months, and deployment two months. This estimation taken is just an example. In total, the total duration of the project is estimated to be 12 months. It means the client is able to use the application and generate revenue only after the 12th month. It also means in this 12 months, there is no value generated or revenue being made. This is what we see in traditional approach of making a software. Next, we'll see how Agile is better when compared to traditional approach. Agile is very popular for the reason that it is value driven. So here the question is, what is value driven? Value driven means early and continuous delivery of value. Let me explain the value driven approach of Agile with the same example as that of online shopping site. Like we saw previously in traditional approach, client is able to make use of application after the 12th month. But in Agile, we plan the project such that client gets benefited early. For example, here I commit to the client. By end of third month, I shall deliver small part of the project which adds business value. That is in this case, I promise the client to deliver working website with a home tab, about us tab, and contact us tab. By the end of third month, with this the client benefits for having online presence, that shows the functioning of organization by having the website up and running. As the client has online presence, it will help the client sign vendors or suppliers. Also, it might help the client to recruit the future staff. Let's call this small module of software delivery as release one. Next, again to add early value to business, I commit to client to deliver second module of working software by sixth month. That is in this case, the ability to add product on the website, which allows the customer to purchase the product by ordering on the phone with the cash on delivery option. It means by end of sixth month, the client is able to generate a revenue. Let's call this module of software delivery as release two. Next, again, to add early value to business, I commit to client to deliver add to cart feature and online payment facility which allows the customer to purchase the product with online payment feature by end of ninth month. Let's name this as release three. Lastly, I promise the client to implement good to have features 
like block tab, sale tab and some finishing touches by end of ninth month, calling it as release 4 and making it a complete project. Let's see the overall development of the project. Instead of making a client wait for 12 months, like in traditional approach, here in Agile we put effort to give early benefit to the client by developing this software incrementally. This is the concept of value driven approach in Agile. Now let's see who can take this course. Anybody who works in IT can join this course. Let's say it can be a developer, it can be a BA, a software tester, a project manager or anybody who wants to take the job as a scrum master. Next we shall look into the job prospects in Agile. In order to get good estimate of job market, let's check the job portal that is in this case career builder. When we check the traditional approach of making a project that is waterfall, I found 25 pages of projects that are based on waterfall methodology. At the same time, when I search for agile based project, I found 176 pages of projects that are based on agile. So this is a huge difference. Next, let's get overview of the module that will be covered in this course. We shall begin with introduction to agile. Lesson number two would be on agile methodologies. Project initiation would be lesson number three. Next lesson would be on release planning, very important lesson. Iteration planning would be lesson number five, where we will be discussing more into iteration planning and implementation. Next would be a small lesson on agile team and its role. After that, we will see some pointers about agile for BAs and testers. Last lesson would be on reviews and retrospectives. For detailed syllabus, I recommend everybody to visit our website at www.h2kinfosys.com. We will be starting the batch shortly. The total duration of the course would be four weeks, that is one month. Also, this would be a lifetime enrollment, which means student can repeat this course as many times they want, but the fees is just paid for the first time. For registration, kindly call 770-777-1269. Also, you can email us at training at h2kinfosys.com. Thanks for taking time to watch the presentation. Hope to see you in my regular session. Thank you once again.